Hey, my friends, welcome back to the orchard. Finally got a beautiful non-rainy day in the orchard. So it's time to hook up the big mower and try and knock down some of the tall grass one last time uh, before winter sets in. Out here, it's, don't know if you can tell or not, but the grass along next to the trees is down a little bit, but the stuff in the middle is really thick. And I want to knock that down before winter sets in. So let's hook up the big mower and uh, get started mowing this thing. All right, she's all fueled up, ready to go. Just got to put my fueling funnel back on my funnel tree. If you don't have one of these, I recommend getting one. This is my funnel tree made out of PVC pipes. Let's put my fueling funnel there. Line it back up so any uh, old oil residue or fuel residue drips out the bottom into that uh, gallon pan. And that way my funnels are nice and clean the next time I need to use them. And I don't have uh, oil splotches or drips anywhere around the shop where a funnel has been sitting. All right, I need to get my headphones, uh, sunglasses, and then we'll go hook up the old mower. Gotta listen for the click. Well, I've been uh, getting a small hydraulic leak here. I'm not sure what it's coming from, but uh, hopefully on this mowing, I can track down where it's coming from once I pressurize the system. But this is a hydraulic line to lower the bat wings. Good to go. Well, looking over the mower, I do have one issue I need to fix before I start mowing. So uh, here, let me show you. This tire right here lost pressure and the tube came out. So yeah, I got to remove that tire. So and see if I can get the tube back in and hopefully the tube's not torn or anything and uh, see if I can get that to hold pressure. All right, let's go change it. Let's see, what do we have? 19 millimeter. Go get a 19 millimeter socket for the other side. 19. 19. Something tells me this little tire is not going to hold air. Here, let me show you. That right there is probably a clear indication that this will not hold air. So I got to see if I've got a spare tire up here. Got a few of them, but I'm not sure if I've got what I need. I, I guess I got to go up there and check. Well, I found this, which is an 11 4 by 5 which matches this one, which is an 11.45. Same diameter, should fit, should work well. If you've ever done any sort of construction or machinery work long enough, you'll always discover that there's at least one hiccup or stumbling spot every single time you wanna do a job. This one was the flat tire, my replacement tire. The hub is too wide to go in the tire holder. So I got to run up, get a new tire. A little bit of degreaser on the fingers. 
I ever mentioned how much I really like this thing? And if you got a shop, I recommend getting one. No, I don't sell them. Don't affiliate market them. I just really like it. Your hands are a mess. You don't have to touch anything gross and grimy. Just out comes the paper towel. All right, well, that tire's back on. Time to start mowing. Well, that's done. Tractor's put away and uh, time to head home for the night and uh, see what Mrs. Jay's up to for dinner. I have just left the orchard for the last time this winter. The uh, harvest is done. I got about five gallon bucket full of nuts and uh, the orchard's cleaned up. The equipment is put away. Everything is winterized and I am off to warmer climates. Now one thing about this channel is I started it to kind of journal my journey of starting this chestnut orchard and to let mom and dad know what the heck I'm doing up here and to kind of keep them involved and engaged in what's going on along with my children who also live in Florida. My parents live in Florida currently, they're retired down there and they really don't make it up to these parts very often anymore. Anyways, I just wanted to let you know that and uh, for about the next five months, the content of this channel is going to change. It's going to be basically about what I do in Florida. Keeping mom and dad abreast of what I'm doing down there and that sort of stuff. I'll make it back up to the orchard occasionally to check on the trees and see how the everything's holding out through the winter. But other than that, the channel will just be about stuff I'm doing. So, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for sticking with me and subscribing. Um, and, uh, well, I better get back to paying attention to driving. All right, take care.